A bill in the Alabama legislature that supporters say targets communism is close to final passage. If it does pass, it would prohibit Chinese citizens, including Chinese entities and government bodies, from purchasing property in Alabama. WSFA 12 News political reporter has more on the reasoning behind the bill and what some Chinese Alabamians think about it. Sponsor of the bill, Majority Leader Scott Stadhagen, says the state's, quote, agricultural and manufacturing resources are critical to the success of our state and our nation, and that this bill ensures that those facilities, those resources, and those installations will not be neighbors with the CCP. This bill to prevent Chinese purchasing power will also impact non-resident Chinese citizens. We are doctors, we are teachers, we are professors, we are realtors. We're holding legal papers to stay here. We pay tax here. Dr. Bowie Tan works at Jackson Hospital. He fears this bill will impact the statewide shortage of doctors. Excellent young physician, just finished the training in New York City, and I present a job. And uh, I talked about this, and he was absolutely no. There's also opposition within the state house. Tell me how this bill is not violating fair housing and federal law and targeting a certain race. We're targeting a community like a communist country to prevent a communist country from purchasing, purchasing land in the state of Alabama. The land includes for a home, which is why some Chinese Alabama residents are concerned. I'm afraid this kind of discrimination will spread to the other Asian ethnic groups. Uh, how could you tell? You cannot tell based on the look. So the only way you have to ask a certain people to demonstrate their loyalty. Part of the bill excludes citizens and entities of Taiwan, as well as Chinese businesses already in Alabama, instead allowing them to expand and purchase more property. In Montgomery, Aaron Davis, WSFA 12 News. That bill will be in a committee on Wednesday afternoon, we're told. If approved, it would then go on to the Senate floor for possible final passage.